how to play. You will be shown a subtraction problem on screen and will have 30 seconds to figure out the problem. Copy the exercise below or next to the answer that you think is correct. If you get the answer right, you're safe. But if you get the answer wrong, you have five additional jumping jacks to do. Before we begin, let's practice. You'll see the problem 2 minus 1 equals question mark. You have to decide what the answer is. If you think it's 1, you're going to do the dabs like the astronaut next to the number 1. If you think the answer is 3, you're going to do the floss dance like the astronaut next to that number 3. You're going to have 30 seconds every round to figure this out. Make sure you do the dance or the activities until the next slide. Ready? Go! If you got the answer one, you got the correct answer. Two minus one equals one. So if you got it right, you're safe. You can relax for a second. But if you got the answer wrong, you have five additional jumping jacks to do starting now. All right, it's time to play for real now. Get ready. 11 minus two equals if you think the answer is 8, do the hand wave. But if you think the answer is 9, do the upper body wave. answer is nine. If you got the right answer, great job. If not, you have five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. Up next, 14 minus six. If you think the answer is eight, show me your best volleyball serve. If you think the answer is seven, show me your best jump shot. is 8. 14 minus 6 equals 8. If that's not the answer you got, you have 5 jumping jacks to do. Ready, go! Get ready! 8 minus 6 equals... If you think the answer is 2, raise the roof. But if you think the answer is 3, copy the Napoleon Dynamite dance. If you got the right answer, you're safe. If you didn't get to, you have five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. Can you tell me what nine minus five equals? If you think the answer is two, do a crossover with a spin. But if you think the answer is four, copy the carrot single ladies dance. answer is four. If you got the wrong answer, you have five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. Here's an easy one for you. Five minus five equals, if you think the answer is one, do some jumping jacks. If you think the answer is zero, do some sit-ups. If 
you got zero, you got the answer correct. If you did not get zero, you have five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. Up next, seven minus two. If you think the answer is five, do a modified push-up. If you think the answer is four, do some leg raises. two equals five. If you got the answer wrong, five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. 14 minus 11 equals. If you think the answer is five, do some swimmers. If you think the answer is three, do some over the head reaches. You got the answer three, you're correct. If not, five jumping jacks to do. Ready, go. Get ready. Six minus one equals, if you think it's four, do a one-armed push-up. If you think it's five, do some shoulder presses. If you got it wrong, you know what to do. Five jumping jacks. Ready, go. Get ready. 10 minus seven equals. If you think the answer is three, do some sit-ups. If you think the answer is four, do some upper body stretching. equals three. If you got it wrong, do five jumping jacks. Ready, go. Get ready. Last question. 17 minus six equals. If you think the answer is 10, do an oblique crunch. If you think the answer is 11, balance on one foot and lean forward. The correct answer is 11. 17 minus six equals 11. If you did not get the right answer, you have five jumping jacks to finish out the game. Ready, go. Thanks for playing with Detroit Physical Education. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube at Detroit PE.